in Chasivyar, Ukraine. City workers say deaths and bombings are now regular occurrences. They say their main job now is to convince people who are still here to evacuate the city. Many people have already left and some humanitarian aid is still here. We want to move this humanitarian aid from here to a safer place. Shelters here are called invincibility points, providing electricity to charge phones and internet access. About 20% of the population remains in Chasivyar, but most of the city services are not operating. On every block, homes and businesses are damaged or destroyed. It was damaged. The windows were blown out. Yes, mostly the windows blown out. We cover them with plastic tarps. We cover them and life goes on. Chasavyar is about 10 kilometers from the city of Bakhmut, where the longest and deadliest battle in Ukraine is currently taking place. We took this video in January, while Bakhmut was under heavy fire. Most observers, like journalists and aid workers, haven't been inside Bakhmut for more than a month. At that time, civilians were barely surviving on donated food and water in basements and shelters. As aid workers deliver food and water to the invincibility point in Jasav Yar, they say this city looks eerily similar to what Bakhmut looked like a month or two ago. This city is heavily damaged now. The last time we were here, it was in one piece about three or four weeks ago. Ukraine says it plans to launch a massive counteroffensive this spring after winter battles that have killed many resulted in few advances for either side. Heather Murdoch, VOA News, Chasivyar, Ukraine.